everybody welcome back to our channel today we are at fun villa the new facility in guelph it was about 19.99 per child to play for the day now you can come and go so it's not ridiculous but i was 50 dollars by the time i had to buy socks for each of the children we're gonna show you around So here at Fun Villa, there's lots for the kids to do. There's basketball, there's trampolines, there's slides, there's the tube slide, there's mazes, there's like a lava type course, there's all sorts of mirrors and obstacles for them to climb and jump and things like that. The trampoline area has a basketball type court as well. And then there's those air bags where you can do the jousting, which is very cool. There is a ninja area. Now the ninja area is for six and above. The kids tried it, but obviously they're not quite six. There is a really nice little toddler area for, for the little ones. It had musical instruments, a little play area, and um, obviously everything was soft surfaced. For the adults, there are some massage chairs. There's an area to sit and just watch the kids. There also was, you know, just an, it, a free Wi-Fi. Free Wi-Fi for the adults so that they can take pictures or, you know, surf their phones while the kids are playing around. And, yeah, I'll give you a little bit more detail about the snack bar and things in a bit. I was extremely impressed by the facility. Obviously, it's clean. It's brand new. Oh, the girls were wiping things down as I was there. They wiped, I saw them wipe tables, like and they were in the okay. play areas oh, wiping things down as well. They Every time they walked into the play area section, they took off their shoes. So it was really nice to see. And as long as they maintain these things, I think it's going to be a really great place for kids to play. And obviously during COVID, it's a little bit different, but ideally when we're past all that, it'll be, you know, more kids and the kids can play together and things. But we didn't find any issues at all with them uh, having any kind of social distance. Another benefit to this facility is, is they have a, basically a reasonably full arcade. And right now, if you happen to go, it is no cost as they are still installing games. They're still in the middle of kind of getting everything together. Uh, yeah, so that was a bonus for us today. We got free gaming, which was cool. I hope you like this video and I hope you watch it to the end. Leave us a comment for sure. And click that subscribe button right now. Girl. Daddy, this is not bouncy. Yeah, it is. Come here. Come here, guys. Just come. Oh, Daddy can't go on those, buddy. Look at me crying, guys. Do I look like a jumping bunny? Yeah, do you look like a jumping bunny? I'm not sure how you're climbing that. That's pretty impressive. What's that? Hey! Hey, Dad! What does he need to go there?
trick, honey. You show me. It's very impressive. Good girl. age six and above. So all in all, there's only like one other family here. So the kids basically have the whole facility to themselves right now. It did cost, well, the socks were $2 a pair. So they got two pairs of socks but we did pay $49 to come here for two kids. But if you take off the socks, I guess that's about 45. But you can play all day if you choose. They do have a food court, which we'll show you in a little bit. Hi, buddy. You guys shoot the ball. No, we can't be over there. It says no adults. Dad, you can do it right here. Yeah, here, I'll film you from over here. Ready? Throw it, throw it. Oh, Daddy you missed. Try. Thank you. Try again, you try. Okay, shoot it in the hoop. Dad, can we do something now? Sure. Let's go. Okay, come on, this way, Sierra. Oh, good girl. Oh, 
is that real water? Wow. Look at that. I got fish. You have to put water on your hair. Are you guys walking on water? No. Lying on water? Yeah. Wow. It's watery. That's why I check with me. No, I don't think you jump on it. Is there fishy in there? Yeah, and stars and fish and sharks! Mm. Oh my mm. gosh. It's a water truck.
place to store your shoes and things of that sort. which is nice to see. Lots of tables below to sit down with lots of distance in between. There are a couple more people here now, but they're still relatively empty, so to speak. And this is nice to see. You can have your drink and snacks up here and they put outlets for charges, but they also have USBs on them, which is pretty commonplace these days. You're starting to see that in a lot of hotel rooms and around the resorts. It's excellent. And then the washrooms, which are right here. And you can see the washroom sign right there. Let's have a look. Oh, automatic lights, it's good. Our social distancing protocols. Touch-free drying for your hands. Basic boys bathroom. Yep, that's fantastic. And then a change station as well, which is nice. And of course, hand washing. And soap and water protocols, which you know what? Thank you public health for every kitchen doing that every time, cool this side. And that's a really good looking mirror. And then of course, a couple more stalls for, for kids. No, oh, that's great. Excellent. So as always, everybody, thank you for watching our channel. Like and subscribe. We'd love to hear from you. Leave us a comment about uh, if you've been at this new facility, if you plan on going, if you have any questions at all, let us know. We found it very safe, and I think that you would quite enjoy it. It was a little pricey, obviously. I, I think twenty, basically twenty-five dollars a child is a bit much, but hey, they had a blast. We had a great time, and I would recommend it at least maybe once every one in a while. Okay, have a great day. Thank you. Go play. Why don't you try these slides? Ugh, that hurt my arm. <laughs> <laughs>